Now that the fire is out, the County of Sonoma is inspecting many of the damaged areas looking for hazardous materials. One of the first to be inspected is the Oak Ridge Angus Ranch, just below the geysers, not far from where the Kincaid fire started. Ranch owner Frank Mangini remembers that night. It was 1,200 acres, and then in a matter of two hours, it was gone. 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 The fire swept across his land. He says the wind was like nothing he had ever seen before. In a matter of minutes, it was just a firestorm, literally. They claim wind was 92 miles an hour. I don't know, but we were standing outside, and embers big as your head were going by. The flames traveled over 600 head of cattle. They were open space and they could actually run through the fire. Yeah. And you could tell some of them were fire, they were singed, their hair was singed. The uh, some were burned, but uh, remarkably not many died. Three generations lived on this ranch. Most everything was burned to the ground. The county arrived and started inspecting for hazardous waste. So before debris can be removed, we want to make sure there's no household hazardous waste. They are looking for paints, old propane tanks, even asbestos floor tiles, all marked for special handling. Then there's this, Geiger counters looking for radiation. A background radiation check is one of the items that must be confirmed. None was detected here. The county believes all the inspections across the county will be completed in three weeks. Dr. Mangini remains positive. You're born into it and it's a way of life and uh, take more than this to kill us and beat us down. In Sonoma County, Don Ford, CBSN Bay Area.